Hi Dress Up Cuties, Winnie here. Today we're going to draw Selena Gomez from her music video Ice Cream with Black Pink. So let's get started. To draw Selena, let's first start by drawing her face. So I'm going to come right here and basically start with the bottom of a U. So I'm going to go right across and connect it. There. So I got a nice little bottom of a U. I'm going to come back to where I started and draw a circle for the eyes. So right on the edge, I'm going to come right here and draw a big circle. And do the same thing on the other side. Go right here. Okay, so now that we have the circle in, let's make them draw so cute eyes. So I'm going to come in here with two small circles for highlights and a curved line at the bottom and shade in the top. And the lines at the bottom and same thing over here Okay, so now that we have the eyes in, let's come in here and we're going to add some lashes. So I'm going to come down and add a big curve and in to create the first lash. And then I'm going to come right to the top and just draw a smaller one just to add some more and one more just to spruce it up. So same thing over here. So curve. Moving this curve and then down and out. One curve and then a smaller one up here and then another one. There. Okay, so then let's give Selena a sweet smile. So about right in this area, I'm just going to go ahead and draw a curve slightly upwards and cap it off. And let's draw her brow. So above her eyes, come up about right here. I'm just going to draw a soft arc and just thicken it up. And same thing here. Soft arc over her eye and down. Okay, so now we have that in. Now let's draw her ear. So let's come to the um, outside right here where her eyes are and then in this area I'm just going to pop out a curve and before I finish that curve I'm going to come in here and draw this big loop hoop earring that she's wearing and thicken it up and then I can just come in here and draw two curves for some detail and same thing over here so big curve but then before you finish it just come right in here draw it big hoop and thicken it up. And the details inside for her ear. And now we can go ahead and finish the top of her head. So let's bring this up a little bit more. And you're just going to imagine an oval. So that's our goal right now to imagine this oval. So say about right here in the center. And I'm going to go slightly up and then down to connect. So same thing over here because her hair parts in the center and connect. And let's come over here 
and she's going to start to build her hair. So center part, I'm going to come up about right here. I'm going to go up and then down. Give it a slight angle and then connect it back. So same thing here, just go up, down, and give it a slight angle and connect. And then for some details right here, center part right here, let's add a little curve right here just to give it some detail and here as well. And you can draw some parting lines if you like in the center. Then for the rest of her hair, we'll do that later um, after we draw her body. So let's come to the center and give her a neck. So right here in the center, small little neck, bring it out. And same thing on the other side, bring it out. So she has these really poofy um, sleeves. So we can't draw the rest of her shoulders yet. So just using this as my guide now that it's pretty even on both sides. Let's come down a little bit, say about right here and here where her armpits would be. And we're just gonna go ahead and draw a slight angle line. So this just helps us build her body a lot easier. So using this as our guide now, let's um, I'm going to come back up here and connect this. And then I'm going to draw her top. So let's bring this down a little bit more. And I'm going to come up right here, go all the way down, plunge it down. Same thing on the other side. And then right in the center, we're just going to draw this knot. And then we're going to draw the tail of this knot. So it curves just like drawing a leaf. And another one. Add some details right here in the center. And then let's bring it in. So about right here, just bring in a curve. And about right here. So then for some crease detail, you can come in here and um, just draw some curves coming out. And if you like, I'm going to add a little curve right here so it's not so low. <laughs> okay, so then let's continue this down. And right about right here, I'm just going to go across for her shorts. So this is the band, waistband for her pair of shorts. And then we can go ahead and pop out her shorts. So it's kind of like a skirt almost. So I'm going to flare it out. And because they're pretty low, so say about right here, I'm just going to give myself a little angle from this center. I'm just going to draw two very slight angle lines because like I said, her shorts are kind of like a um, pair of just a skirt. So right there and I'm just going to go ahead and connect it. Give it a little wobble so it's not so stiff and you can just draw some details in here very lightly. Some crease lines. Okay so then now we can go ahead and draw her legs. So I'm going to have this one kind of out to the side and this one straight. So it's kind of about right here. And I'm going to bring this all the way down. Right there and then tapering as I go down. And about right there, I'm going to start to flare it out for her feet and then bump it out right there and then round it off and then connect it. So then the other leg is straighter. So about right here, just want to make sure it's about the same size. And once again, I'm going to angle this down.
And then about right there, draw her shoe. So flare it out. Just make sure you're ending up at the same area. And connect. Okay, so now for some details. Let's come right here. And we're gonna draw a sole, give it a little curve, and then the top part. So right here, curve and in, then curve. And then two small curves <laughs> for the shoe. So same thing over here. So we're gonna draw a sole, the top part of her sneakers, and make sure it's about the same area. Curve, cross, and two curves. So just a very nice simplified way to draw some sneakers. And you can pop it out if you like. There. Okay, so now finally her sleeves. So let's come over and work on this hand, which is um, to her hips. So I'm gonna Curve this out and bring it down. Just give it a little dent in and poof it out. So about right here, you know, poof it out and connect it. So we just have to imagine her arms are kind of out here. So that's why I'm making the sleeves come out about right here. Wobble across, give it a little cuff. Draw some details in here if you like. And so now let's come right here, give her an elbow and bring it in. Because her part, um, the top part of her arm is in here, you won't need to draw that, just the bottom part. So let's come here and bring in an angle down about right here, I'm just gonna bring out this little curve for her fingers and in. So um, this side is a, um, her hands down, so it's not gonna be as poofy, but we still need to poof up the top. Bring it down. And I'll bring it all right here, same area. Wobble across, give it a little cuff. details and the other hand so let's bring this out it's gonna pass this part so by right here and here it's gonna give her thumb oops and fingers there Okay, now finally her hair. So let's come back up here where her ears are. And I'm just gonna wiggle and wobble my way down just to simplify her long hair. So same thing over here. And tuck it in. And when you color her um, outfit right here, um, this part has a lot of polka dots. So it's a lot easier if you have one of these like white out pens or any kind of like maybe acrylic paint and you can just, after you color it in yellow or blue, just go in there and dab it with these uh, pens. It makes it a lot easier than having to draw circles and color around them if you have these pens. <laughs> okay, so that is pretty much it, except oh my, almost forgot. Um, Let's add a, where should we add the heart? Da, 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 da. Um, let's add it right here. I don't know if that makes sense, but I have to add a heart, right? And give Selena here a heart <laughs> to make her my Jurassic to Selena from her music video with Blackpink called Ice Cream. So thanks so much for watching. I really hope you love my version of Selena and how she turned out and this inspires you to draw it too. Thanks so much for watching. And if you loved it, please make sure to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss any new Jurassic videos. See you later.